Hey everybody, today we're gonna to talk about our jack strap, our new RIT tool that's gonna to be how we carry the RIT bag. It's a carrying strap that also acts as a functioning strap for a down firefighter. That's what we're gonna get into today. The jack strap is a RIT tool. It's intended to be attached to the RIT bag for when the RIT team is deployed. When the down firefighter is found, the jack strap can be detached quickly from the RIT bag. Once detached, locate the bracket on the down firefighter. Apply one carabiner from the jack strap to it. Wrap the nylon webbing across the chest and under the arms of the down firefighter. Attach the second carabiner to the opposing bracket of the SCBA. Remove the plastic slide from the loop holding the nylon webbing. Disengage the handles from the Velcro strips attached to the webbing. Use a sewn-in loop as a handle and cinch down on the cam buckle to attach the firefighter to his back plate. At this point, use the handles to drag the firefighter from danger. Now let me show you this application in real time. I'd say 40 seconds is pretty good. As the jack strap has been hitting the field and companies have been training with it, even more applications have been found. Civilian rescue by hooking the carabiner to the D-ring around the civilian's body, single firefighter application, removing a firefighter from a basement, bypassing the handles and using the D-rings for a drag. And of course, this could be used in a crawling position. And take notice how the firefighter's face piece has always remained intact. Now, unfortunately, we have to get into a little bit of the boring details. Let me tell you about the materials and the structural integrity. The strap is made of four basic components, a carabiner, two inch polyester webbing, handles, and a cam buckle. Basic construction for basic use, make it quick and efficient. We have tested the breaking strength of BA products where the product is manufactured. As used, the minimal breaking strength is 5,010 pounds. With the initial break being at the one inch webbing with one handle, the rest of the strap stayed intact. The second test was done at the D-rings bypassing the handles. They failed at 6,539 pounds. Even at that point, it was a matter of the stitching, not the structural components, the firefighter remain intact. Throughout all of the testing, the carabine has never failed. The two inch polyester webbing has reflective stitching and is rated for 12,000 pounds. The carabiners and handles also come wrapped in reflective tape. There's Velcro stitched on the handles and the webbing to keep the strap in place when not being used as a drag. A two inch cam buckle that well exceeded manufacturer's ratings during every test. Lastly, it comes with a plastic slide catch that's designed to keep the strap linear when used as a carrying strap. And just to reiterate, none of the structural components, meaning the strap, the carabiner, the cam buckle, nor the D-rings, failed during the testing process. So that's it. That's the jack strap. And that's how it works. If you want to get in contact with me, all the contact information is in the description. Thanks again for watching. You guys be safe. Thanks again.